it's Patini Gal, and I am here in a brand new pack called Techtopia. And uh, I haven't done much research on it. Uh, I've tried to watch some, but uh, yeah, we'll get into it, see what we can do. Hope you guys are excited, and uh, let's get to it. So, um, I did fly around a little bit uh, trying to find a place, and I actually found a village. So, we're going to start here and uh, see what we can do. So, the, it comes with a little bit of a book here. It just kind of tells you, Welcome to Tectopia. A villager overhaul mod with over 20 complex villager professions and 18 different structure types to add to your custom built village. So, to get started playing Tectopia, please visit our wiki uh, to learn the key concepts of running a village. Trust me, it's easier than reading this tiny book. Okay, so there we go. So, let's get started. Um, I'm just going to go ahead over to the village. And as you can see, we've got this line here that's kind of, uh, I, I think it's signifying just the, um, like, spawnable area around the village. Uh, because we will have, um, there's a skeleton horse. Um, we will have uh, nomads that come into the village that we can actually um, turn into whatever villager we're wanting. So... If I can, if I can get up here, that'd be great. Okay. So let's see what we can find. I haven't been through this village. I don't have a clue what's here. So, uh, we got a li uh, library. That's cool. Um, and there's these little, um, I think they're called markers that this marks the, uh, a home for the villagers. So we've got two villager, uh, beds here. And what else we got? We got two there, two there. Wow, this is a big one. All right. So as you can see, this the um, spawning of it isn't great. Some of them don't have markers on them. Some of them do. There's another bed. So if we look here, um, I keep forgetting I changed my key to right click, which makes it a little bit difficult to get these guys. Come here. <laughs> All right, so um, I may have to change my key back because I can't get these guys. All right, so this guy doesn't have a profession, but um, uh, he's got full health, almost full hunger, happiness, and not very intelligent. So I want to find different uh, villagers here. Here's one. Come here. Yeah, I'm going to have to change the key back to the right click because I can't get these guys these guys are so fast all right come here okay forget it okay so I want to find the town hall because the town hall is the main thing that's what like starts your town out and we can either take over this town here's the town hall this is uh the marker for it so we can either start a new uh village or we can take over a village that's already here which I, I don't know. I mean, this isn't the greatest village, but uh, we've got, obviously, we don't have that many emeralds. So we got to figure out what to do here. We've got the mine, wait, mine shaft. Okay, so we have all of these different tokens we can give to the um, villagers. Um, we've got a farmer. We've got a teacher got a druid we've got a uh, rancher a guard what is she doing she must be a, a lumberjack we got a chef we've got a butcher a lumberjack cleric miner enchanter blacksmith and a bard I don't know what a bard is but okay so the town hall is supposed to come with a chest. So I don't know. But let me know down in the comments what you guys think. Should I take over this village or um or find another village? Let me know. But let's go ahead. Oh. Wait. Am I Oh, hold on. I think I'm still in. <laughs> hold on. Uh, game mode, I forgot to change this back. Like I said, I did fly around to try to find a place, 
and I totally forgot to change back. Okay. I was going to say, that wood is way too easy to uh, break. All right. Much better. Okay. So, this is a very light uh, pack. I don't really know, um, even if it has that many mods, it has the, uh, oh great, it's raining. It has the, um, m the mod for the villagers. That's, I think, about it. So, let's see. Can I just go in here? Can I sleep? Um... I did add the journey maps mod and um, also the inventory tweaks. So I did do that. And um, let's go ahead and get some more wood here because I want to get stuff we need. Because if we do stay around here, we're going to have to uh, try to, like, you know, protect the villagers because we don't want anything, you know, killing them. Because that wouldn't, that wouldn't be good, right? So, uh, yeah. Let's see. Get one more. Hopefully that's it. Nope, it's not. <laughs> of course not. Alright, let's see. So, I do want to go around and see if there's anything, anything good in the chest here to get. Because that will help us a lot. See, if you look at them, um, if we can. There we go. This one is a farmer. And you can see she has a garden tool, uh, some seeds, and some wheat already in her inventory. And the intelligence is only six, which, stop moving me, which isn't bad, uh, but, you know, definitely can get better. So, let's see. I want to go find, I know we went around a, where do we see that blacksmith? Because they usually have a, um... I, I gotta change that key. That is annoying me. Uh, they usually have a chest in there. Here's some beds here. And they're yellow until they're claimed and then they turn green. So that's a pretty good, uh, pretty cool. Wait, damage. Who who took damage? Um, okay. I don't... I didn't hear anybody take damage. I don't know where they are. Okay, so let's go ahead and make a crafting table. Let's see. We'll do that. Because like I said, if we stay in this village, we're going to have to help these guys out. All right, so let's do that. Um, if we don't, we'll, I think I've, I said this, we'll have to take the marker from the town hall because that's the only way you can get a uh, town hall uh, if we make our own, uh, our own village, which you guys know me. Building isn't my strong suit. I could, like, take over a village and try to make it better. Oh, I was like, what is that noise? So let's let's see what this guy has. Uh, he's level two lumberjack, and he's getting kind of hungry. Okay. So let's see how this goes. So they will cut down the tree and they will replant. So that's super cool. Um, but I need weapons is what I need. So I'm gonna look over here. Let's go ahead and make ourselves a uh, pickaxe. Let's see that. We'll just make a wood pickaxe and get some of this. Oh, Creeper. Jeez. Thanks, Creeper. Appreciate it. Okay, that is annoying. That sounds like... I don't know what that sounds like. That sounds like something crazy. Okay. Um. Oh, did he... No, there it is. I was like, did he take the, the item frame? Okay. So let's put this back. Uh, there we go. Okay, I hear stuff. This is probably not the best thing to, the best thing to do. It's, you know, probably not the best place to start, but okay. Alright, so if I could do the right thing here. Let's go ahead and click that. And there we go. So we've got our pickaxe. Let's go ahead. 
and get some of this cobble. Well, let's look. Well, this is part of a building, but I doubt it's very, very useful. Okay. Let's just get some cobble here. Yay, Stone Age. <clears throat> All right. So one of the things that is going to be hard for me to live without is JEI or NEI, whatever you want to call it. <clears throat> um, but obviously I don't want to... I don't want to put something like that in here because I don't think that's going to work. Um, there was one other uh, thing I wanted to try to install, and that is the uh, Wayla, so we can actually see what we're looking at. Um, but yeah, like I, I, I just for now I just have the uh, journey maps and inventory tweaks, so it, it's fine. It'll work. So let's go ahead and make ourselves some, uh, we'll make ourselves a stone pickaxe. And I'll probably finish uh, this off first for the um, pickaxe. We'll make ourselves a stone axe and we need some more sticks. Instead of doing that, let's just do it this way. I always forget about this part of vanilla to use the book here. So there we go. Super cool. Okay. I don't like that sound. That I I keep thinking something's like gonna walk up behind me. Alright, so let's take that. Okay. So I wasn't sure. Cause the town hall should have Oh, why didn't it like Put a chest here. I'm going to try this. Let's take this off. And then put it back. I don't know if that's going to work, but we'll see. <clears throat> so, yeah, we definitely don't have the emeralds to do anything here. But one of the buildings is supposed to spawn... A chest that has some emeralds. At least I thought so. Uh, this is just another. That's a guard. That's level ten. That's super cool. Um, I need to. I need to make a sword. It's probably a good thing to have, right? Let's do that real quick. <laughs> it's probably a good thing to do. Uh, sword. There we go. Not that I'm that, you know, that good with a sword, but at least we have it. God, it's annoying. Uh, I'm gonna have to put the lumberjack, like, a ways away just so we don't hear that. If I, if I stay in this village. Again, let me know in the comments what you guys want me to do. Do you want me to keep this village and just kind of try to work with it? Or do you want me to find another one? So I, there's a lot of, um, <clears throat> excuse me, <coughs> there's a lot of houses here. I don't know why all of a sudden my voice is like, nope, not going to work. There's a lot of houses, but not what we need. So that, that kind of stinks. Come on. Uh, let's see what's over here. Nothing. Okay. So that looks like another house. Oh, here we go. This is what I was looking for. Do we have anything good in here? Uh, not too bad. We got a diamond. I was kind of hoping for some emeralds, but we got an iron pickaxe. Some gold. Diamond apples and oak saplings. Don't really need the oak saplings, but okay. We'll take it. And I'm going to go ahead... Oh, wow. That's a lot of stuff. Okay. Alright. Go ahead and take that. Um, where is that coming from? Where's that zombie? Oh, it's probably... Under here? Maybe? Nope. That just goes right through. Where is that zombie? I hear you. 
Okay. Oh, man. My nose is, like, not wanting to cooperate right now. Okay. So, this is pretty much just kind of an, an intro. Um, like I said, let me know about what you think we should do about finding another village or uh, trying to kind of make this one look look better. I mean, the generation of these uh, is not great. Not great at all. But, you know. I guess I guess it's what you get, right? And it's getting dark. At least we got a guard, right? I mean, is the guard just going to hang out and... <laughs> Oh, come on. <laughs> so, as you can see, they each go... Oh, he just closed the door in my face. Okay. They each go to their own beds. And the thing with the villager mod, uh, this villager mod, is uh, to keep their happiness up, it's probably best to not sleep at night. But for now, obviously, I would want to sleep because, you know, I don't want my village... These villagers to get eaten. Um... Or killed because I'm not exactly sure if I'm going to stay here or not. So, you know. With this, though, it's easier because um, you actually have the nomads that spawn that you can turn into whatever um, villagers you need. So, it's not like the end of the world if you lose some. But I still don't want to lose any, right? So, um... So yeah, I hope you guys are excited about this. I'm super excited to try it out. It is going to be something new for me because there's not, a, you know, a quest book per se. And um, so we're going to have to kind of figure out what we're going to do. And um, so hopefully you guys will help me out with that. Uh, let me know what you guys want to see. And, um, you know, I'll, I'll do it definitely. There, there's a zombie somewhere, and I don't know. Oh, my goodness. Oh, there's a zombie, and I don't know where it's at. <sighs> and we already had one of the villagers take damage, but not exactly sure what they took damage from. So, I mean, it didn't say it was took, took damage from a zombie, but I don't know if it's going to say that. Uh, can we just right-click these? Nope, that's not a thing. Okay. I didn't think so. Just wanted to check. Okay. So we're getting we're getting some uh, advancements done, so that's good, right? Even if it is just from finding stuff in the chest, we still got it. Still a thing. There we go. Uh, is this the only farm that these guys have? Because if so, we need to do something about that. Because <laughs> these guys are gonna need food. Um, so we got to keep them, you know, keep them full and uh all that fun stuff so we'll definitely have to do that we'll probably try to do that uh next time uh but i i'm not sure if i'm going to do an episode right after this so let me know about uh, what we should do if we should um make a new village uh or try to find something else or use this one i mean the random um uh buildings everywhere is a little crazy but you know we can work with it if we need to and um yeah so i'll probably just work on trying to get some more materials in between um probably do some more mining sorry my nose is just not not like me right now um and i i need to find emeralds but i i've got to find i've got to get like coal and stuff first so we can have some torches, you know. So I may just... I hear a zombie down there. I hear you. Oh, there's coal. <laughs> Ask and you shall receive, right? Okay, so yeah. Um, I think that is about it. I know this hasn't been the, the most exciting, you know, first episode ever. But uh, I, I am super excited to uh, try out this mod. And, uh, like I said, it is very light. Um, as far as I know, it just has the villager mod in it. And I will put the link down to, uh, Tango Tech's, um, YouTube page. If you want to check that out, he is the maker of this, 
uh, mod pack. So, yeah, I will put a link down there. And uh, somebody took damage again. Just two. I don't know what they're taking two damage from, but okay. So, yeah. Um, and I think that's it. So, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. If you have, definitely hit that thumbs up. Also, if you're new to my channel or haven't already, go and hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the bell to get notified of videos as they come out. And if you want to play this pack or check out any of my social media or Patreon links, they're all down below in the description. And, um, yeah, I'm, I'm super excited. I'm, I'm excited to play this. And it'll definitely be kind of out of my comfort zone kind of thing. So, so you guys will have to help me out with that. Um, you know, let me know what you guys want to see and uh all that fun stuff and yeah these guys are just everywhere so um they are kind of slow so it's going to take a bit to get what we need but um yeah i'll try to go do some mining and see what i can get and i think that's it so uh leave any comments su suggestions tips anything like that down below in the comment section I love to see those, and um, we'll get back with you as soon as I can. Until next time, thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you later. Bye, guys!